Alrighty, so had a small disaster. Lost my Proteus to some rats. They two shot me. Uh, so I'm rebuilding here, and what I've done is taken another uh, Proteus that I have, and um, that was something that I would call experimental, and I am uh, rebuilding it. So, um, and this is a, this is a PVP fit, not in a normal sense. Um, it's, uh, it is designed basically that it doesn't have any, um, range control so I can't hold them there no web no scram but I can go out and work sites and stuff and if I get tackled I can definitely defend myself and it will um, uh, and uh, maybe they get dumb and don't run away Something like that. I don't know. All right, so let's see here. We've got probe launcher this, and then two of the small Nosferatus, and then we've got three of the ditch. All right, so we've got two of the small here. And it looks like I need to buy one more. Hopefully there's some out here. Mm. Holy shiz. Man, they're expensive. Really? They're really that expensive. Look on my guy who's out in the Jita region. And soon, hello. Man. The premium out in Null is enormous. It's double. Yeah, see, somebody just really jacked up the price out here, and they're about to get it from me, because I need one more. Unless I put something else in there. I mean, I suppose I could put a bubble nullifier. come back around to that. I don't know that I want to spend that much on that. I mean, if these are really going, I mean, that's... Thank you, Rebel Man. Hello, welcome everybody. Um, we're rebuilding this Proteus after I lost one to rats. Um, which was quite stunning to me. <laughs> um, I got two shot by some rats. Uh, let's see here. The This um, energy neutralizer being this expensive here in uh, Jita, they're running for 90 million. And um, yeah, very strong rats. Well, I think that I didn't have the right resists and um, it was a ghost site. Yeah, and they, they hit me like a truck. I mean, literally, um, 
it it went so quick that I was stunned. Um, especially for a Proteus that you know costs about two billion. It was a significant loss. But you know. That's the game. Anyway, I am gonna come back around on whether or not I put another um, energy neutralizer on this or not. Because cost is outrageous. I might switch it for something else. So, all right, so that's done except for the, um, the open spot. And then this side is all done. So the uh, mid, all right, did I, did I save the cap battery? No. So hopefully we got one of these out here. 72 million. All right. Welcome to the dragons. Revo underscore man one just followed. And then uh, Revo man, thank you for the follow as well. Two billions like your whole account? Yeah, I mean, um, I did not have the money on this character to just replace it. Uh, so I'm really lucky that I had another Proteus out here and um, that was uh, a piece of shit fit so I didn't mind tearing it apart. So, um, all right, and I'm lucky to, like I lost my Zugma and the Zugmas are extremely expensive. Um, yeah, 435 million for that. Uh, I don't know though, what are they out in Jita? Four hundred and ten, so it's not too far off, you know, the null premium as I call it. Um yeah, not bad. So I, I happen to already have an extra out here, so I got really lucky on that too. Now for the lows. And let's see here. Oh, I got both my armor repairs. Saved both of those. Sweet. Alright. So, these are going on the outside. And then, drone amplifiers and Imperial Navy. Two of those, two. Two drone amplifiers. I wonder if I can, what's available on the market out here that's special versions of these. So, let's see how much of a difference. I, I'd spend a couple hundred million if the um, difference is enough. So this is drone damage bonus 20.5 and these are 23.8. Hmm. Really not, I mean, that's like a 15% difference. I'm certainly not going to go officer. But let's see if a couple of these are available. They are 200 million. So that'll give me like a 15% boost.
I think I want to do that. Let's all fit it out except for this spot right here. Um, I didn't even get my drones out when I got attacked. That's how fast it happened. I'm thinking of maybe a, the bubble nullifier up here. Um, if, I don't know what it's called, though. Let's, uh, let's finish up the cargo and stuff. Um, right, let's see here. For the drones. Got half my drones here. So I need four more praetors. Four more sitting here. And then I need four more salvage two drones. Augmented Acolyte. Probably gonna be ridiculously expensive. For a light drone? Yep. Let me see here. Should be it. A little fit. There we go. All right, so now to figure out what that, uh, what's that top piece called? The um, is it a nullifier? I, I'm not sure that that's the name. Interdiction nullifier. All right. Yep, there it is. Okay, it fits in just fine.
So, what does this one do? Prediction nullifier. Percent bonus to warp velocity and acceleration, 15% reduction in cap capacitor, 80% reduction in interdiction nullifier re reaction delay, and max walk range penalty. 100% bonus interdiction nullifier duration. If I put that in though, I lose a, um, I lose a low. Go in here, hyperspatial optimization, bonus to agility, bonus to warp speed and velocity, two additional low slots. Yeah. So, what is going to be the duration on this? Because it says it gives it 100%, so it doubles the duration. Um, reactivation delay, 150 seconds. It's almost three minutes. Activation time duration, 15 seconds. <clears throat> I think that if you activate... It, it, tell me if I'm wrong on this. But I believe that if you activate and get into warp before that time, that it is still active at landing. In case you, you know, there's another bubble on the other end. It's just we have this almost three minutes reactivation delay. And um, so. Drone bandwidth penalty, negative 50%. What? Holy shit, I can't use this. Drone bandwidth penalty, 50%. Scan resolution, 50%. Maximum targeting range, 50%. Holy cow. So, drone megabit per second. that offline. Yeah, it halves my drones. Oh, there's no way I can use this. There's no way. Boy, I would have been, uh, I'm glad that I noticed that because I'd have been shocked if I got out into a fight with another player and found I could only throw out half my drones. That's not going to work. Mm -mm. Put an auto-targeter up there. Put a smart bomb up there. I think if I put a smart bomb up there, yeah, then I can last two minutes. But how much damage would that be? It's 350. It's, a, it's an okay amount. Oh, my power grid is like way puking on that. All right. What else can I put up there that'll be of use? Well, you know, how about an armor repair? And it'll really be so that I can repair my own drones. Or, oh, what if I put command bursts I'm up there? I'm an equal opportunity ass kicker. Grekor just subscribed. Grekor, 
Look at that. 93 months. Getting a long time there. How about eight? No. 6,510 gold. Everybody here? In Grecker's honor. You're all French because of him. Yeah, drone range extender. Uh, this tends to to be more of a brawler fit, and so I don't think I really need to extend. And I'm not gonna be, I'm not gonna be sitting out uh, doing a lot of salvaging with this or whatnot, where I, then I can park it and kind of forget it. You know, the drone range extender is nice because sometimes you have stuff spread out further. Um, but yeah, um, what about a command burst or, um, or something to repair drones? And so, you know, in all honesty, my, my armor rep on this is actually pretty good already. And so, in the command burst area, um, really? Minus 9,000 CP. Well, that ain't going to happen, then, is it? Um, I thought I could put command bursts on these, but I guess not. I guess it'd probably have to be a different configuration. It probably requires different modules here. So, an armor repairer, um, Ancillary. Yeah, so that might be good. We wouldn't be running it all the time. It's really just to repair my drones if necessary, which we ran into yesterday needing to repair drones out on the fly. Armor is the most common. Yeah, I think that'll be it. Medium remote armor. For the moment, we'll try that. What the hell, man? Look at that. Somebody's selling them for 988 million. Five of them? How much money did they have to pay to list that? And what the hell? That's just crazy. You know, we have dipshits everywhere. Even in our own alliance, right? There we go. I'm happy with this. I think this feels pretty good. And, and it was kind of good 
two to go over everything again because I've been using that fit for a couple of years. And uh, so, you know, the, um, it, um, just time to, to revisit it. I don't like giving up that little bit of energy NOS neutralizing though. And the reason for that is, is because that is my secret weapon against other players. To get them to buzz off. This isn't really a killing machine, it's more of a defense machine. Thing of beauty there. Actually, no, we haven't been running it that long. We built this six months ago. But anyway, it's always good to to revisit the stuff. Um, I'm still horrified by how quickly I died. I mean, it's like crazy. Uh, cinch all this stuff up again. Repackage all of it. good for me to sell these. Hundred and seventy five million each. Does they go for ninety eight? market man out here being a little bit crazy. it is on these in yeah. 99 All right we're gonna bring it down I'm gonna make some money but I'm, we're gonna bring it down lower premium on a lot of things out here but even even a 50% premium that I put on it is a little bit high but I'll take advantage of that help recoup some of those losses these blood reactors what's going on with this so 12 and a half million each Let's see what those are going for out in Jita. Well, that's that's perfectly fine. Go. And four hundred thousand. All right, everything else. 
just hang on to. Avatar Relic convert while playing Eve. You use it whenever you want to. Interesting. He's kind of remembered their groups from my last ship and they put themselves into them. That's really interesting. Works though. And what's my top drone damage now? Should be a little bit higher. 675. Yeah, it was like 629. That's a little bit of an increase. So instead of 1.9 billion, this one's 2.1. Convenience tax, right. The convenience tax. all set up. Opportunities right now. Scan two combat sites. Capture contested faction warfare complex. Destroy 25 non capsuleers mine 2,000 units of ore. All right. We look at intel here. And this guy here, we need to offload this stuff. this up and he heads back to Jita
All right. Bit of fleet here right now. So, we're going to go out looking around again. Um, let's not lose another Proteus today. One is plenty. to another one of those uh, sites that was a uh, it was a ghost site we're running to another one of those I'll just do the first can and get out that's the way it'll be finding Jack out here. Couple of hierarchies and then something else. Something else is here.
data site. Abandoned Research Complex. Not safe. Oh, that's right. Rats appear if you... Um, rats appear if you fail on it. Pull in those probes. Second here. It's going to take me just a second on this customer. Let's go sit down near it. And we'll see if uh, anybody happens to come in and go to it. Take me a minute.
Give me just a second here. I'm... have uh, the uh, skill codes that we've got. They are giving an error that's incorrect. They're saying they're not valid when you've applied one to your account previously. And if you've applied one previously, then you can't apply a second. But then it comes back and says not valid. And so it obviously makes people think that, oh, the code is bad. That's what I would think. But no, it should say already redeemed, which is their normal messaging. I've already talked to CCP about this and they're trying to get it changed on what it says. So, all right. Let's go and run this site. And if I die in this one for some reason, I just am going to just be 100% beside myself. <laughs> It'd be like inconceivable. don't die yeah well if you fail on these then there are rats that spawn I don't know what they are though just for good measure I'll go ahead and turn on my armor rep right now Actually, fail this one. Armor rep is on. Maybe it's on the second failure. Prize is nothing. Oh, awesome. I don't want to waste room on a scanner. There's the money. 60 runs of ogres, 60 runs of hammerheads, and 60 runs of hammerheads. Very nice. I'll take that all day long. I mean, integrateds are not that much better 
than than the others, but there is a market for them. That's actually a really good, usually you get maybe one out of a whole site here. Um, I just got three, so I, uh, I'm feeling pretty lucky again. That was nice. I'll take it. Oh, that feels so much better. That's how it's supposed to be. It's not supposed to be the wham bam dead. I mean, obviously it's supposed to be. I just didn't like it. <laughs> Alright, given all my bonuses, I just have to scan down another combat site. These are. Oh, it's a hierarchy and a radiance. Is there really any difference between them? Suppose I could just scan the bookmarks. support. I appreciate it. All right, that's the hierarchy. So let me just scan down the... So we got the first thing. Scan two combat sites. All right, if you're watching on YouTube, wait for the next episode. <laughs> 